Hello YouTube, this is Desires and this is another editing tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do the a hardcore colour correction that I made which I used for Phase Tico's mini edit and my episode 20 and it looks very clean, it goes well with optical flares and yeah it's just a basic hardcore colour correction really so I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do that so I'm going to be using a plugin called Looks Builder by Magic Bullet Looks. It only comes with um, After Effects and Sony Vegas, but you're going to have to download it separately. There are ways to get that for free, so if you go on YouTube, there are videos how to do it step by step, really. So when you do have that, I'm going to be showing you this collection. You won't have this as a preset. I'm just going to be telling you the settings and effects and what sections they're in. And it should look like this. You can change the settings as much as you want after to your liking so I'm just going to give you the basic settings really so first we're going to leave subject out we're going to go into matte section and we're going to have the first effect as warm slash cool so when you go into tools the matte is highlighted and the effect warm slash cool is there so just press on that and drag it and the settings are warm slash cool is on uh, minus 0 0.529 tint is on 0 0.173 and exposure compensation is on minus 250. Okay, we're gonna. This is another effect diffusion, and it's also on the matte section. So when you go on matte highlighted diffusion, and these are the settings. Size is one percent. Grade is two. Glow is eighty-eight percent. Highlights only is thirty-seven percent. Highlight bias is minus zero point two four eight, and exposure compensation is zero point eighty-eight. And for the RGB, red, green, and blue for the color, it's they're all going to be 0 0.549, and it's just going to give out a basic white color. And we're going to the lens section now, and it's only got one effect in it, and it's called Vignet, and it's a effect which makes the uh, size of your screen darker, and, it, and it's like a very important effect if you want to do a uh, hardcore color correction really so this is a very important effect you can change it as much as you want after these settings really so my settings I roughly use is um, radius 1.056 spread is 1 fall off is 0 0.500 strength is 75% and exposure compensation is on 0 for the RGB color everything is on zero so it's got um, just a black effect because it's, it's black dark fig net and we're going to go on to the other section which is camera and the effect is called free strip process so I'm going to go down here is free strip process and the settings for these are strength is on minus four four percent and exposure compensation is on plus 0 0.45 and that's it for that and now the last section which is called post there's the effect color curves which is just called curves and the setting for it you have RGB highlighted and the contrast is on zero shadows is minus 0 0.400 midtones is plus 0 0.550 and highlights is plus 1.050 and Oh yeah, and the gamma space is 2.20 right at the bottom there. Red is, they're all zeros except from the gamma space which is 2.20 and the same of green and blue, so make sure all them settings are the same. And the last effect which is also on post is saturation which is there. So just also drag that in and the uh, settings are saturation 68%, exposure compensation plus 0 0.50 and for the RGB all of them are at 0 0.609 which also gives it a basic white colour for the saturation so this is all it that's all the colour correction all the effects so if you use it with optical flares and use it for hardcore edit it should look really nice now for more editing tutorials uh, please like the video it will make me want to make more and also give me suggestions for other editing tutorials this has been Desires and thanks for watching.